That's ghosts. Ew, that's science. It's bull. I can prove it. Here's the scoop on poop. It all starts in your mouth. You are totally gross. I'm talking about the digestive system. I'm listening. The digestive system starts with your mouth. When you feel hungry, you might pick a red apple. Here, take a bite out of it. Chew, chew and chew. Your back teeth are now grinding the apple into small mushy pieces and mixing it with saliva. When you swallow, it then slides down a tube called the esophagus. The esophagus has muscular walls that push the food down. Then it falls into your stomach. The strong muscles in your stomach and gastric juices break down the apple. Gastric juices also destroy any germs. Sometimes you can hear this all going on. Correct! Your liver helps by producing bile, a greenish fluid, which helps break down certain food groups, particularly fats. Your pancreas also helps by giving off digestive juices, which follow into the small intestine to break down protein. The small intestine breaks down fats and soaks up the good nutrients and gives them to the body. By the time the apple reaches your large intestine, all the good stuff has been taken away. The large intestine deals with leftovers like undigested food and bacteria. As water is absorbed, this waste becomes more solid. It gets propelled towards your rectum where it is stored as feces. The muscles of your rectum squeeze the feces out of your body through your anus. I was your king. The feces, or commonly referred to as poop, gets the smell from bacteria. A healthy person's poop has about 30 to 100 trillion bacteria in it. So the animal that lived this way was really healthy, eh? Hey? Oh, oh, yeah, very healthy indeed.